Hello everybody, Rob here from Average Hobby, and today I wanted to do a quick little video showing you how to breathe life into your old Army Painter War Paints and even the new War Paints Fanatic. So basically what you can do uh, with your old War Paints, if there's certain colors that you really like or certain colors that uh, you want to come up with a reason why to keep them, um, you can actually turn them into speed paints, which to me kind of blew my mind. I couldn't find anything on YouTube, so I wanted to do it now uh, to show you. So basically all you do is you take one drop of your war paint or your fanatic. We'll do it here. One drop, there we go. The reason why I want to do uh, night scales is because there is no actual black metallic. And then, shake up our speed paint medium here real quick. And we're gonna do five, five drops. One, two, three, four, five. We're gonna give that just a quick little mix here. Usually takes a few moments, and yeah, and there you go. We now have a black metallic speed paint. Uh, to be honest, it's actually just that easy, but I haven't found any videos on YouTube showing what will happen if you add speed paint medium to Fanatic or even the War Paints range. So yeah, so there we go. Um, so what I've done to breathe some life into my uh, War Paints, you can see some of my tests here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, basically, what I did was I just did a drop of the paint, in this case, green skin, and then one drop of speed paint medium, then two, then three, then four. And yeah, and so far I found a good five or six drops of speed paint medium for every one drop of uh, of your war paint or fanatics paint. Turns it into a good speed paint. So if there's a color specifically that you want, or if you want to save some money because you have the fanatic paint and you don't have the speed paint, well, there you go. Like I said, five or six drops depending obviously on the actual paint itself but yeah so there is our black You're really nice you can see it flowing nicely there here is a red which you can see it's still a little flowy here's our blue that's still a little flowy as well our green skin this might not be up oh, no it's still a little flowy and then this is the ogre skin speed paint from earlier um, it's been sitting here for a little while, so it'll be a little more So, <laughs> But yeah, so there you go. Five or six drops of speed paint medium to your war paint or fanatic, and there you go. You have a speed paint. Um, you can also use a little bit of airbrush thinner. Um, one thing you can also do is Army Painter Air, um, and then add a couple drops of speed paint, and boom, there you go. Um, but yeah, so just a quick little thing. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate, appreciate you, and I'll see you in the next little uh, hobby tip video or hobby quick thing.